All right, guys, real quick, real short video. We're going to show you how to stage a drag car. This is very important when you're drag racing. You got to learn how the staging system works. Very simple. We're at Rockingham Dragway. Let me show you real fast. Super simple. Go to turbojohnracing.com, comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks, guys. All right, guys, well, here we go. This is the Christmas tree is what we call it. You've got on the top here, you've got the pre-stage, and then you got the second set of bulbs. This is the stage, and then you have ambers. You have one, two, three ambers, the green light, and then the red lights are on the bottom. So back here at the staging lanes, here you go. This is the staging area. You can see over there on this side, there are laser beams. It goes to this box. You got one on each side. So if you're in the left lane, the left half of the tree is yours. If you're in the right lane, the right half of the tree is yours. So basically what these are, these are lasers in here. And watch what happens as I move my foot into the beam. So your tire is over here and then as you creep forward, this means you are pre-staged. This is, means you're almost ready to go. You're about ready to let go of the trans brake button, but not quite yet. In order to turn the next bulb on, you have to continue to roll the car forward, and it rolls forward about another six inches, and then you keep creeping, keep creeping, and then the stage bulbs come on. Now you are fully staged and you are ready to go. Now the left lane, of course, there's nobody over there. If there was somebody over there, you both turn on the pre-stages first. And then once both stage lights are turned on, then the tree is ready to drop. So she just flickered in, boom, you'd get the ambers if you were on a pro tree and then the green light, and then you take off and go. So pro tree, what that is, is all three of the ambers flash at the same time. Usually it's on a four tenths pro tree. That means the ambers are on for, for less than a half a second, four tenths of a second, and then you get green light. Now you don't wait till you see green to go. If you wait to see the green, then you're gonna have a very, very, very bad reaction time. So you let go when you see the ambers and then you're set. If you're doing bracket racing, usually they do 500, uh, pro, uh, 500 sportsman tree. That means each one of those ambers is on, on the bottom of the tree. So you, these three ambers down here, they are on for a half a second a piece. And it staggers down. So that's the basics of how to stage a drag car. Uh, the key thing to remember is once you turn on that pre-stage bulb, you're pretty much ready to go. And that's telling the other opponent you're ready. It's telling the track you're ready. It's telling everybody that you're going to roll in here in the next couple seconds. And then boom, it's ready to go. Let's go drag racing, guys. But the biggest thing to remember is depends on what type of drag racing you're doing. If you're doing bracket racing, generally you get the full tree. And if you're doing index racing or heads up racing, that's when you get the pro tree. So it depends on what you're doing, where you're at, what the track is. Always make sure you find out before you go up there to make a pass because you want to be prepared when you stage a drag car. This is how you stage a drag car. If you've never been to the drag strip, we hope to see you out there. We want to see the sport continue to grow. Y'all take care. Comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.